Hey folks, Italian Woodward, Fish Hounds Guide Service. It's been a while since I've had any videos I've put on my YouTube channel, probably, I don't know, four, five, six months. Uh, I got real busy with the guide service. I just didn't have the time to sit down and, and edit all this. So I've got a lot of footage stored up in my uh, computer I'm gonna start bringing to you. Um, you know, the editing part of this, I'm kind of slow at still, and so it eats up a lot of my time trying to get this videos edited out, but I'm trying to get better at that, but anyway, so I got a lot of stuff that's saved up that uh, I'm gonna start putting out there. This trip here is actually from May 29th of this year. Uh, it's a fellow by the name of Mark Townsend. Uh, he's from Texarkana, Texas. Uh, I believe, uh, I wanna say he owns a bunch of Wendy, a little franchise of Wendy's or something, and uh, uh, really, really big businessman and, and uh, an avid crappie fisherman. Uh, so anyway, it was a pleasure to guide him. Uh, he fishes a lot of lakes. and. Uh, North Louisiana, North Texas, uh, kind of jumps around lake to lake. He wanted to get on Toledo Bend. It's such a big lake. He wanted somebody to, to kind of show him the ropes out here a little bit. So anyway, we went out and he was at really wanting to catch big fish, just like uh, all good crappie fishermen uh, want to do. And so we targeted uh, a lot of uh, uh, natural structures, standing timber, uh, trying to trying to target our, our bigger fish. And uh, but anyway, we did hit some spots that was holding uh, large quantities, like you know, a couple hundred fish on one big pine laydown that fell over into the river channel, and uh, caught a lot of small ones on that. Uh, but uh, we we caught a lot of lot more big ones this day than, than small. Uh, at the end of the video, you'll have to see them laid out here on the table, and there's a lot of a lot of good slab fish in there. But anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. But uh, I want to take a minute and uh, give a shout out to ACC Crappie Sticks. Uh, I'm excited to say they've added me to their pro staff team. They're sponsoring me now. Uh, they're, uh, so we're gonna try and, and put, uh, put their poles on our boats for our customers to enjoy. Uh, these, are, these are top of the line. These guys have built an awesome pole here. Uh, I, you know, I've just now started getting them in my hands and catching fish with them. And I've, I've got it a couple of trips where my customers actually were using them. I don't have uh, all, all my poles on my boat replaced with them yet, but I, I will here in the near future. And, uh, but I just want to say, you know, uh, I think what's going to, what it's going to be with these poles is, is, uh, the, the, the sensitivity is, is huge for me as a crappie guide. Uh, a lot of people that I'm guiding just don't, uh, they, they don't do a lot of fishing, you know, and that's why they're out here paying me to, to take them. So, uh, there's days that the fish are real finicky and, and, uh, uh, they just can't feel them bites, you know, and we actually the first day I used these poles was one of them days And it was just me and a friend and we were just goofing around doing a little scouting and I could just tell right off the bat that uh, the, What you can feel on these things even bumping around brush with a jig or something uh, you, you just can feel more than I've, I've used B&M's for, for years and years and, and I'm not knocking B&M B&M makes a great pole uh, for the money, Sam Super Center is, is, is an excellent pole, but uh, I think these here are, are going to be hands down some of the best crappie poles ever made up to this point. And uh, so I'm excited to start using them. I'm excited to team up with them and, and uh, uh, really, really happy about uh, the relationship uh, we're going to build in the future. So anyway, uh, I'm not using these poles on this video, but I will have videos coming up soon that we will have uh, all ACC crappie sticks in them. Uh, but anyway, I hope you enjoy this video. I want to take a minute and talk to you, you know, and uh, about God. Uh, I just want to tell you that uh, take a minute every day and, and uh, spend some time with God and, and uh, you know, give him, give him the thanks and the glory for, for just allowing you to be here and, and, and uh, alive each and every day. And, and uh, you know, I've lived a lot of my life that uh, I've always known God ever since I was a little boy, but uh, there's been a lot of my life that I was distant from God and, and they were the worst years I ever had. And so I can tell you from, from experience that just, just giving God time and love every day is, is, uh, is going to make your life a, a thousand times better. And, and it's just a good feeling to know that you got the big man behind you and no matter what happens, you, you certainly don't want to be alone in this world without his support. So. But anyway, hey, I hope you enjoy the video. Uh, we was mostly using on this uh, uh, blue ice with a pink head, Bobby Garland. We use a lot of hair jigs too, and uh, but it was all all jig fishing uh, that day. And, and uh, so I hope you enjoy the video. Uh, if you hadn't liked my uh, subscribe to my channel, I, I really ask that you would. I appreciate your support, and uh, we're going to be bringing a lot more to you in the future. Uh, thank you very much.
big a pile right back to the uh, Spider wire, man. Yeah, it might be. Bright line. You can see it so good on that screen. You can't see this stuff on that screen. That would concern me. Yeah, I'm fixing to put this up. <clears throat> All you gotta do is show me one time. <laughs> Oh, this is the best one I got on the boat right now. I hit a tree that uh, I hit. We all hit a tree that I've been uh, had. We hit it about a, three weeks ago on a trip because it was the only place I could fish that day. And, uh, Battery? Yep. I got a nice fish. Going? Down and a half, aren't they? Yeah. Like it, might be a little better than you think, you know. Yeah, no. No way, no way, no. She's probably pound and three quarter, maybe a little over. Got it? Yeah. Like the grease thing now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, before I leave, we'll give you a uh, yeah. recipe on a, I got a cream of wheat crush puppy recipe. Okay. Yeah, it sounds good, Now we started out with a pretty slow bite this morning and we hit quite a few spots that uh, had fish on almost every place we hit just wouldn't do anything and we made a pretty long run here probably I don't know three quarter half three quarters of a mile I don't know if that changed it or just during that time we was messing around they might have turned on for us but uh, we just kind of staying back off of them a little bit just trying to pitch at them and Pretty good. 
good right here. Working on a lemon. Had one of the old honey holes here, hadn't been to in a long time, and actually hadn't hit it since probably February or so. And before that, it's been a couple of years. But this is uh, one of the old sweet spots, they're still here. These are all solid black crappie, they hit it just about every pitch or two. Finally got Mark on some fish, they've been slow all morning, and we just had to find the right one. So, we're gonna wear them out, hopefully. Yes, sir. Solid, man. Don't be catching no babies, baby. To lead a bend slaps. Long way to go. It's only 15. Jump. Yeah, that's uh, my bad on that. Yeah, let me start. Uh, well, yeah, because yeah, you're used to fishing braid. You can manhandle more. <laughs> yeah, you can't do it with this game. Nope. Here, use that other one to fix that jig. Let me tie this one. We're getting.
Yeah, I like it. That's an old one too. It's starting to get a little bit stiff. I probably need to oil it. tree that fell off the bank right here years ago and used to fish it a long time ago but anyway it hangs out off the kind of off the shelf of the river channel and hang, hangs out over into the drop of the river there's probably what yeah probably 200 fish or a bunch of small ones we've caught a couple you know, medium keepers but uh, there's a there's a ton of fish here there's ever been 150 200 fish on this spot Yeah, they're tucked down that log, aren't they? Hey folks, Tiger Woodward, Fish House Guide Service. We got uh, Mark Townsend from Texas County, Texas. Big crappie fisherman, uh, fishes a lot of lakes, Lake of the Pines, Wright Patman, number of lakes. He jumps all over and wanted to get his feet wet in Toledo Bend, and so he booked a trip with Fish House today and uh, wanted to go after some big fish. We've actually filleted, I forgot to do a little quick video, but uh, we got some pretty good footage out there. We hammered on a pretty good bit there a few places, and. 
Uh, we was targeting big fish today. Uh, he didn't want to hit the brush piles where all the little small medium fish are kind of stacked up right now. So we skipped over all that stuff and fished uh, mostly just natural standing timber and, and some big lay downs we know where we're at. And, and uh, found some good fish. We got a few smaller ones in here, but most I think we probably had 40 that, that were all solid fish like these right here. And uh, so it was a pretty, pretty good trip. Had a good time. I got to wet a hook a little bit. One guy on the boat always makes it funner than having a huge group, so I enjoyed it. What do you think about it, Mark? Oh, man, this is the first time I've been to Toledo Bend, and uh, I'll, I'll tell you guys, if, uh, it's a it's an intimidating place to be if you don't have the right boat. So uh, if you're going to come down here, uh, I suggest going with this guy right here because he's got a great setup. Appreciate it. And, uh, we had a great time and enjoy spending the day with him. Yeah, uh, Mark here owns what, how many Wendy's? He owns a franchise of Wendy's out of Texas, up around the Texas County area there. What, you got 10 of them? No, no, we got uh, eight. Eight, uh, 10, close enough. So <laughs> yeah. he's a pretty successful businessman. I was proud to have him. I enjoyed the day with him. And so uh, hopefully he'll come back. Yes, sir. I appreciate that. Yep, we'll All be right. back. Yeah, deal. Enjoy it.